Hi guys, welcome to this team of the season Joe Bryan review for Green Smash 24 Switch Guys with awesome for more bonus and if you're new to the channel please subscribe and follow me on Twitter at G's Legend. As we can see guys he is in my Football League Team of the Season team with four other Team of the Season players which we will also be reviewing. He has 85 pace, 60 shot, 65 pass, 70 dribble and 68 defending and 75 physical. Plays for Bristol City in the Football League 1. He is a cracking cracking player guys. 3 star weak foot, 3 star weak foot. 6 games played, 40,250 coins he cost us. Absolutely solid as a rock. Real good defensively, very good attacking. And as you can see, once we jump into the in-game stats and the gameplay highlights guys, You'll we'll see how much I absolutely enjoyed him. Jumping into Joe Bryan's in-game stats, guys. His left mid is what it says for original card, but he's been his team of season card is a left wing back or left back. But his greens are so good, guys. 82 acceleration, 85 agility, 90 balance and jumping, 86 sprint speed, 80 stamina, 80 strength, and honestly, at left back, these stats are phenomenally amazing. He has 76 curve, lots of high decent um, yellows, um, 71 penalties. 6 on free kick accuracy, 6 9 slide tackle, 7 on standing tackle, and absolute positives, guys. 3 star weak foot, 3 star skill moves, as it says, left mid, left wing back, but obviously left back he can play as well. 5 foot 7, decent height for a left back. Left foot, medium medium work rates with no specialties or traits. Jumping Jump. into his in game highlights, guys, he was solid all round, guys. Good passing, good dribbling, even a good shot on him as well, because I got him in quite a few times in games where he was able to shoot quite easily and didn't score for me but some good dangers all round. Like I said defensively he is pretty solid despite being a left mid and his team of the season card being a left wing back. His biggest problem though is his positioning which got comment which gets him caught out on multiple occasions guys. So putting instructions on him won't hurt at all and hopefully will limit him even more um, to attacking too much. But like I said in multiple occasions for me he was able to win ball from attackers and use his strength and also win the ball in the air quite easily which was quite impressive for him despite being not the tallest and it make the big, made a big difference for him getting those plus points in so all in all guys, big, biggest negative is his positioning biggest positive I would say is his um, all round ability so on that 8.5 is his rating so hope you enjoyed, smash the likes, sub if you're new follow me on twitter, take it easy, see you all soon for more FIFA 15 content